He would flash that million dollar smile. Gloria Shaw can't help but smile herself when speaking about her son, Xavier Davis. 23 years old, an aspiring photojournalist, she says he always had a camera in hand. Fond That's memory she's cool. now holding close to her heart. He would have come home. He didn't come home that night. No, he didn't come home. Early Sunday morning, she says her son and a group of friends were headed home from Water Street, crossing the street at 6th and Juno. They were all walking to the car. He was walking in a crosswalk and the car sped up and just kept going. Oh in this exclusive cell phone video, you can hear the desperation and shock. First responders tried to save him, but Davis died at the hospital. To know that he was innocently walking with cousins and friends and somebody took his life like it was nothing. I can't even imagine what was going on. Police now looking for this black Dodge Ram truck with amber lights. His grieving mother misses her only son dearly and believes someone out there has critical information. Put yourself in my shoes. What if that was your kid? What if that was your nephew? What if that was your grandson? What if that was your family member? Say something. Hillary joining us once again. Now people are, of course, encouraged to share any information they have. Exactly, Toya. Police need your help to find that vehicle and the driver. So there's a couple of things you can do. One, you can just call police, but if you want to remain anonymous, call Crime Stoppers. That's 414-224-TIPS. Toya. Hillary Mintz reporting for us live tonight. Thank you.